Hi Ruronis, this is your pal RuronyK95 here, and today I decided to do another anime review. And the suggestion from Earth Knight 3400, here's my new anime review. This time I'm going to review Sailor Moon. One day as she is running to school from home, a young girl named Usagi Tsukino is, runs into a b cat being tortured by some children. She chases them off and removes a bandage from its forehead, finding underneath what she calls a crescent-shaped bald spot. Meanwhile, the evil Queen Beryl of the Dark Kingdom is planning with her servant, Jadeite. To steal energy for the Queen Metallia, Jadeite sends a monster named Morga to the diamond shops run by Usagi's friend Naru's mother, and she drains energy by selling cursed jewelry after failing an exam and later running into Mamoru Chiba, who calls her Bunhead. Later at home, the cat comes and talks to her. It tells her that she is the pretty sailor senshi of love and justice. Sailor Moon is her destiny to save the world from the Dark Kingdom. The cat named Luna gives Usagi a magic brook and tells her to say Moon Prism Power Makeup. She does and trans is transformed into Sailor Moon. Sailor Moon goes to the jewelry store to save Naru and the others from Morga, a mysterious masked man named Tuxedo Mask appears to help Sailor Moon, and she throws her tiara at Morga and says, Moon tiara action. Morga is destroyed, and Jadeite's energy is lost. Sailor Moon foils three more of Jadeite's plans, destroying the monsters, Fro and Derelia, and releasing a, a muscle man from Jadeite's control. Usagi meets a girl named a Ami... Amy whatever you want to pronounce it, whom Luna suspects to be from the Dark Kingdom. But fighting off an attack from Jadeite's monster Garoben, Luna realizes that Amy is Sailor Mercury. So she gives her a transformation pen that, when she says Mercury power makeup, transforms her into Sailor Mercury. She wakes he weakens Garoben with Sabao spray, and Sailor Moon destroys her. After Sailor Moon and Sailor Mercury defeat Jadeite's monster, Ramua, Sailor Moon goes aboard a bus that Jadeite's monster, Keegan, is taken to another, into another dimension. Rehino discovers Jadeite's intentions, so he sends her there as well. Luna gives her a transformation pen so she can transform into Sailor Mars. And she destroys Keegan with Fire Soul. Sailor Mercury stops the black hole from closing, and Tuxedo Mask rescues all the girls from the dimension. After the three sailors send she foil two more of Jadeite's plans and destroy his monsters, Merid and Theritus, Queen Beryl threatens to put Jadeite to internal sleep if he fails again. He challenges the sailor Senshi to a battle at the airport, and but eventually they defeat him and he is run over by a jet. Beryl puts him into an eternal frozen state and freezes him into endless darkness, eternal sleep. Nephrite becomes her new commander, but Zoisite dislikes him and wants to have his turn. Nephrite's plans to gather for Queen Metalia involve draining one person's energy at its peak, as opposed to Jadeite's gathering energy from the several people at once. Wow. By the change, arching into an item to them, uh, to close them close to them with dark energy and <clears throat> eventually a monster would appear from the item however each of his plans were was foiled when sailor moon destroys his monsters tensui patosos black widow and cameron and jumo while he is posing as a millionaire named masato sanjun naru falls in love with him after sending a monster named Regulus, and after Sailor Moon and Tuxedo Mask, and later attacking them into an elevator shaft, Nephrite discovers Tuxedo Mask's true identity. After one more of Nephrite's plans is foiled, Castor and Paul Lukes is being destroyed by the Sailor Senshi. Queen Beryl turns her attention to getting the Silver Crystal and searches for the Moon Princess.
He mistakenly thinks Princess Diamond, Princess D, is the moon princess and implants soul shadow in her, but he is driven out and Sailor Moon destroys him. Eventually, Usagi discovers that Naru is in love with Nephrite and tries to tell her that he is evil. The sen Sailor Senshi fright fight Nephrite and defeat him. Sailor Moon is about to destroy him with her tiara, but when Naru jumps in front of him, forcing Sailor Moon to stop her attack, Nephrite in turn protects Naru from an attack by Zoicite's monster, Yasha, and Sailor Moon destroys her with her tiara. When Nephrite attempts to find Sailor Moon and telling Na Els Naru his real name and that he wants to fight alongside the Sailor Sen, she, she calls Usagi and Nephrite. Right. soon discovers that Naru does not know that she is Sailor Moon. However, Zoicite has three monsters. Hausunka, Grape, and Zo Suzuran kidnap Naru and Nephrite saves her from them. But the monsters return and grab Ape, stabs Nephrite with horns from her arm. The Sailor Senshi destroys all three monsters. But Nephrite dies of his injuries and dissolves into dust. Queen Beryl gets some of his the energy from the Queen Metellia, who tells her to find the seven rainbow crystals, e each uh, of which is inside a er an earthling. One of the seven great Yoma inside Zoid's side attacks down the ga game machine Joe, who becomes friends with a girl named Makoto, uh, exact extracts the crystal from him, then awakens the shadow within, transforming him into an, a game sen. Luna gives Makoto a transformation pin, and she uses it to transform into Sailor Jupiter. Luna gives Sailor Moon the moon stick, and she uses it to heal Joe. The other six characters carriers a priest. Crystal. The other six crystal carriers a pre are a priest, a boy who can d predict the future, who becomes friends with Amy, an artist named Yumio Yumeno, Matoki's girlfriend Reika. Ray's grandfather, and a fat cat named Rehet Butler. One by one, Zoicide extracts their crystals and transforms them into respectively Boxy, Bunbo, Banha, Ryoku, Okiendor, Gigi, and Bibakine. The Sailor Senshi got one of the crystals, and Tuxedo Mask gets two, and Zoicide gets, gets three, bringing his total up to four. All six monsters all healed up by Sailor Moon, killing the shadows with them. Eventually, after fighting off an attack from Akan, an actor turned into a monster by Zoicite. Sailor Moon is forced to hand her crystal over to Zoicite, even though she heals the actor. Queen Barrel's full orthgen, Enerol Kunsite, who is in love with Zoicite, goes with him to attack the Sailor Senshi, and he traps them in a dark dome. Well, Zoicite impersonates Sailor Moon to trick Tuxedo Mask and stabs him. However, he is attacked by Sailor Venus, who then c attacks Kunzite, releasing the Sailor Senshi from the dome. Sailor Venus has her with her cat, a talking cat like Luna. His name is Artemis. Zoicite challenges Mamoru, who is really Tuxedo Mask, to a uh, a battle at the Starlight Tower over the crystals. Usagi comes with him, unaware of what Zoicide is going to do. Before they can fight, Kunsite appears and takes the crystals. Mamoru scratches Zoicide's face, despite the fact that Queen Beryl ordered him to take Mamoru alive so she can turn him into her side. Zoicide tries to kill him, forcing Usagi to transform into Sailor Moon in front of him. Mamoru reveals him, then reveals himself as Tuxedo Mask. Zoicide stabs him with the ice crystal. Nearly killing him, Sailor Moon cries from him, and the seven rainbow crystals merge with her tears to form the silver crystal. She is revealed to be the Moon Princess, Princess Serenity, and Mamoru is Princess Antimon of Earth. Zoe's side attacks Serenity, but she defeats him using Moonstick, made stronger by the silver crystal. Kunsite captures Mamoru and returns to the Dark Kingdom with Zoe's side, whom Queen Beryl attacks kills with an energy blast from her crystal ball as a punishment for disobeying her. Queen Metalia begins to turn Mamru evil. Kunsite attacks the Sailor Senshi, but Sailor Moon defeats him with moon healing escalation. Kunsite is assigned to the task of to finding a uh, finding and destroying Sailor Moon and getting the silver crystal back. Uh, from her, he turns several people into monsters like Mitsui, Shaku, Akai, Blizzard, and Misha, and Janelle. But they are all healed by Sailor Moon Endymion, though he is now evil, often gets into arguments with Kunzite, and even helps the Sailor Senshi out on a few occasions. Endymion, some 
Mian summons the ancient creature of the lake, and, but she is healed by Sailor Moon, turning back to into the spirit of a girl. Kun Sight later tries to recapture the crystal carrier is in the hope that he can revive the seven great Yoma, but his plans rev are is foiled by Sailor Moon, whom heals Endymion. However, Kun Sight recaptures him. The Sailor Senshi pretend to fight each other so they can enter into the Dark Kingdom, fight off Kunsight's monster, Oniwabandana. Sailor Moon restoring her original form, the Sailor Senshi find a tunnel leading into the Dark Kingdom and fight Kunsight. The middle of the battle, they are taken back in time with where Prince Queen Serenity tells them the story Princess Serenity from the Moon Kingdom was in love with Princess Endymion from the Earth. But Queen Beryl and her followers attack from the Dark Kingdom. They killed Princess Serenity, Princess... Well, Prince Endymion and all the Sailor Senshi. So Queen Serenity was forced to use the Silver Crystal and use up all her power her to steal everyone into inside the crystal and all the Sailor Senshi reborn on Earth. After returning to the present, they are attacked by Kun's sight again, who gets much stronger much they see him. Sailor Moon uses Moon Healing Escalation and reflects on one of the energy blades at him, killing him. Wow. The Sailor Senshi head for the entrance to the Dark Kingdom to fight Queen Beryl, who sends the Didi girls after them, and the end, Didi girls and all. The Sailor Senshi accepts Sailor Moon, destroy each other, but Beryl teleports Sailor Moon to the Dark Kingdom to fight Prince Endymion, who has turned evil, but again, Moon healing escalation doesn't work, but Sailor Moon is able to heal him, Oregel. He injures Queen Beryl, and Queen Metellia combines Beryl with her, transforming into a gigantic form. Sailor Moon fights her and transforms into Prince Ser Princess Serenity. They enter a beam struggle, and powered up by the other Sailor Senshi. Use Serenity uses Moon Prism power to completely destroy Beryl and Metellia. All the Sailor Senshi and Mamoru return to Earth safely, with their memories being of friends and Sailor Senshi has been erased. They each go on to their li normal lives, but just two months later, a new enemy arrives, forcing Luna and Artemis to restore Sailor Senshi's memories, leading to the Sailor Moon R, which is the second season of Sailor Moon. And that's how you end this episode of Sailor Moon, where they defeat Queen Metellia and Queen Beryl with Moon Prism power. So that's going to be it for my review on Sailor Moon. You guys, thanks for watching. But before we go, I like to, th I would like to thank Earth Knight Thirty Four Hundred for suggesting me to do a review on Sailor Moon as well, because this is my new anime review. Hope to subscribe for content. My anime plan link in the description down below. You can share this video on your Twitter, Facebook. If you have a Twitter, Facebook account, be sure to give this video a thumbs up. Please leave a comment in this video if you. What are your thoughts on it? Be sure to click on my subscribe button. On, become a subscriber to Ruroni K Ninety Five. Feel free to join. Check out my other videos by clicking the notifications bell button. Don't miss out. This is Ruroni K95 saying, I'm glad you... Is we're running out of time? Because this is Ruroni K95 saying, I'm glad you liked my anime review on Sailor Moon. I'm glad you liked it. Hope you enjoy it. Hope to see you soon. And have a great day, because tomorrow's Thursday. This is Ruroni K95 saying, signing off. And thank you for watching.